Hey guys, welcome back to the challenging game here and in this video I'm going to teach you how to make a health GUI which shows how much health you have on the box here. Let's get started. Alright, so the first thing that you need to do is insert a screen GUI insert inside a star GUI and then you just name this health GUI. You can name this wherever you like, it doesn't matter. And next, insert a frame. And um, now we'll just customize this frame. I'm just going to make it uh, red. This is just uh, going to be the background. And um, well, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to place this uh, UI design by Stellarex plugin. I'm going to place it in the bottom right. And I'm just going to place it in the bottom right on every device. Right, so I'm going to change the size. You can just customize it. You can you can change the size to however you like. It doesn't matter. Um, then I'm just gonna make it look like this. I think it's a little bit small. So I've got the red bit sword and I'm just gonna um, take it away from the corner a little bit. Maybe like 0 0.95. But I don't want it right in the corner. A little bit close to the corner. So that's fine. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna add a border size pixel just to give it a bigger border. So right now it's got black border. I can change that but I just want it black. And I'm just gonna name this frame to health red. And I'm going to have uh, another one, I'm going to duplicate that, put it inside of that, health red. And I'm going to change the border size pixel to zero because you don't need this. And I'm just going to change this one to green. And this one's going to show the health that you have. I'm just going to change the size to 1,0, 0, so it fills the whole thing. Um, but it doesn't right now because um, I've got it in a weird position. So I'm going to use the UI design plugin again to place that in the correct position. And I'm just going to rename this to uh, health green. Again, this doesn't matter. And um, whatever you name it, I'm just naming it just to be organized. Uh, so what you need to do now is insert a script, a local script inside of health green and just copy everything that I type. Make sure you get all the capitalization and names correct, just so that yeah, it definitely works too. Because if you type something uppercase, that's meant to be lowercase, it might not work. So make sure you just type it every, everything exactly how I type it. So it's going to be a time lapse. So, yeah, so just follow along and copy exactly what I do. Let's get started with the time lapse. <laughs> So here I said all player that character added column wait. So if the player's character hasn't loaded into the game yet, we're gonna wait for it to load in and and the script won't go any further until it's loaded in because it won't work. And let's carry on with the time lapse. Right, so that's this script done now. So I'm just gonna head into the game and test this out. All right, so I'm loading into the game now. And as you can see, it's a full full green bar, which shows how I have full health. So if I go into my character in humanoid, then change this down, uh, maybe to 50. See, now the green bars went down to halfway. And you can see the red there. If I change this down to two, it's going to, you're only going to be able to see a little bit. Then if I change it to zero, 
gonna kill me and then it's gonna respawn me and it's gonna be a full battle again so this is gonna be the end of today's uh, YouTube tutorial so if this helps and you want to see more videos like this in the future then make sure you like subscribe and turn the bell to be notified when that video comes out also remember to leave video suggestions in the comment section down below for a shout out more videos yeah that's gonna be it for now and I'll see you in the next video bye Thank you.